Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's something minus me here. So I wanted to come and talk to you guys real quick before I got ready to go to school. So please forgive my face because like all in here is like peeling. So yeah, and I don't know what to do to it. So if you guys know anything that I can put on my face so it can stop peeling and the moisturizers aren't working. So I have to figure out something. So I wanted to come on here and tell you guys how much I lost what I weigh now and some of the things that I've been buying some stuff that I bought today so I'm gonna start with the stuff that I bought since it's like right in front of me so lately like I've been sick and I've been sick for like a week now now I got is much better um than before before I was like really raspy and my voice was like crazy so yeah I was buying soup so they have the Campbell's Chunky and this one is the vegetable one. And I had um, chicken noodle, I think, or chicken vegetable. I had, oh, chicken and dumpling, which was pretty good. It was really thick though. Remind me of like mayonnaise and clam chowder. So I'm not, I will never buy that again. <laughs> you guys know I don't like mayonnaise, right? So, this is about 200 calories for the whole can. There's two servings in here. So, I would normally eat that. And then, um, like, I would have that for dinner. And then the next day for lunch, I would have another one. And then, um, yeah. So, today I wanted to make omelets. So, I, and um, the weight loss group with Ms. Redbone 2010, somebody made omelets. And I'm like, OMG, I want an omelet. So I went out and bought the stuff to make omelets. So I bought a red pepper, a green pepper, and I bought these eggs. Now, I guess I should have bought regular eggs. These was kind of expensive. They was like $7, and it's the beater and eggs. But I'm going to tell you why I didn't buy the regular eggs. So this is what it looks like. And it's a Weight Watchers number, and it's zero points. So the good thing for me is that sometimes I find myself to overeat even on a diet even if I make something um sometimes I can overeat so I see these because they have eggs so when I looked on the, the um the nutrition part on here um it's three tablespoons for 25 calories so today my lunch was about 250 calories um I had like three tablespoons, nine tablespoons of the egg, which I don't even think was enough because my omelet fell apart on me. So on here it says that a regular egg is 70 calories. So I think when I looked at that, I was like, if I eat two eggs, that's 140 calories. And then um, I can't really snack and stuff throughout the day because I'm trying to stay under like a certain amount of calories that I'm taking in. So, um, I decided to um, get that, and it was $7. And then today, I seen Special K came out with these new, like, snack things. And this one is pretzels with white fudge. And I don't like chocolate, but I love pretzels with, like, yogurt and stuff. So, I was thinking it should be around the same thing. And they're 100 calories. So, I thought this was a good deal. These was, like, four dollars or some change or something and i love to snack on little stuff throughout the day and forgive the noise in the background because you know how new york is and this is fiber one i've always bought these and these is 90 calories for each one and it's a coffee cake and my mom loves coffee cake so i figure i will get it so yeah so i bought those two things so that i can snack on um, I usually would snack on one throughout the day and then I have fruit so I bought apples today and then I would eat like an apple or something and um, oh I bought carrots too because I wanted to taste this thing here and I love veggie dip so the veggie dip is kind of high in calories so I wanted to try something else and this one is sugar free calorie free veggie dip and it's from Walden Farms and there's no calories, nothing. 
Okay, so one of you guys was saying that um, your main issue is snacking. Now, I'm a snack girl. That's the reason why I gain weight um, from that and eating out. Um, I don't... See, I like to snack and I don't want to deprive myself from certain things. So what I do is I will buy like banana chips. Um, I'm going to show you in a minute. Banana chips, like dried out ones or like dried fruit or like baked cheese doodles or something um i haven't bought baked cheese doodles in like a month but if you buy stuff like that it has serving sizes on a bag what you should do is bag up the servings throw the bag away if you bag up the servings and it's like say 15 in a bag then you have 15 baggies in the cabinet that will have you know the stuff in it and then you just grab one and you eat it and there will be whatever those calories are. So, I just eyeball it. So, it might be a little bit less or a little bit more than what's for the serving size. But, you will get the, the point. So, I bought the banana chips. It was about like three, three servings in it. I wind up making it four servings. So, I added an extra serving to it. And then, when I leave the house, if I know I'm going to be out for a couple of hours, I would just grab one of these out the cabinet. Put it in my bag with some water and keep it moving. Um, also, I will buy like trail mix. You know, trail mix is pretty good, but it is a kind of high calories, like 210. So the bag that I bought was about four servings and I made it eight. So I cut the calorie, the servings. I cut the servings in half, well, double the servings. And then I cut the calories in half by making it 120. And then I like to eat 100 calorie, 100 calorie snacks. So I could have cut it down from 8 to 16 and then it would have been less than 100 calories. So um, doing something like that can definitely help with um, with snacking. So uh, let's go over my weight loss. So you guys know I have a little card here. And I write down every week. Um, Mondays is usually weigh-in days. And Monday or Tuesdays. And um, I like to weigh in on Mondays. It's right after the weekend. And I can just jump straight into it. So my starting weight was 304.2. That started February 3rd. And now March 3rd. Which is today, right? Yeah, it's today. <laughs> I weighed 293.0. So I lost about 11 point something i think 11.2 but let me be on the safe side and look for you guys just give me a minute sorry i should already had the number figured out right so i think it's 11.2 this week i lost 2.2 pounds which is great i told you guys that i want to lose at least two pounds a week so that's definitely a great thing for me that i lost what I wanted and I did and I did meet my monthly goal of 10 pounds so I was excited about that so well eight pounds because I'm gonna lose two pounds a week so let me try to find the calculator here which for some reason I don't even think I have one on my iPad <sighs> okay I have one sorry guys so my starting weight was 304.2 and I'm currently 293. So I lost 11.2 pounds in about 30 days. And I haven't been taking any supplements. I don't do any exercise. I just changed my eating habits. Today, I suppose we're going to get my gym membership, but I have school at 2.30. So it's over at 5. So I'm thinking about going to get it at 5 o'clock when I get out. Just going straight to Planet Fitness and getting it. Um, by next week, Monday, I want to be in the gym and working out. So, um, I'm excited about that. So, yeah, I'm down 11 and, points. Um, you guys know I have PCOS, so it makes it harder to lose weight. Um, so my weight this whole month has been going, like, up and down. I've cheated one time, and I had, um, well, let's say twice. So the first time I cheated, I had a cheeseburger and french fries, and then I came home and had a beef patty with cheese so um and that was like two in the morning so i try not to eat after a certain time and if i do then i it's like a snack or something um after that um last week friday we had chinese food i had shrimp 
and vegetables with garlic sauce with rice and some steamed dumplings so i don't call it cheating i just you know i just ate it out ate out or whatever um i did what you call it um i didn't eat all the rice i think i ate like two or three um spoonfuls of the rice i think my body knows that i'm not eating it and i haven't eaten rice in a month i haven't eaten fried foods no junk food no soda definitely had nothing to drink but water so yeah i'm excited about that that i'm getting my body on a healthy track so yeah i'm excited and to everybody who's on a weight loss who lost weight this month and they are like sticking to it i'm so proud of you like yes miss redbone 2010 facebook page if you own a weight loss journey her page is private you have to ask to join it so um just know that before you um ask her to join that you must be on a weight loss journey um on mines it's open you guys could just add mines we don't have no like interaction on mines it's not enough of us it's only about like seven and i don't think any of them are on a weight loss journey but i do post every day all day every meal i had what i um lost every monday or game so yeah um i'm gonna put a picture in here of my body i'm so like ugh, i don't even want to do it but i'm gonna do it because i put it in a weight loss um in a weight loss thing and yeah i'm gonna put it up because i, I want to be able to make the progress and i want to be able to see where i started so and since i'm gonna start going to the gym this month i definitely want to put it up so you guys will see it in this video at the end um i was going to post a few things of the foods that i ate so i might post that too so yeah so yeah guys thanks for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed and um again i will leave below in the description box the weight loss pages so you guys can follow them i know it was something wrong with the link in the other videos but i did go back in the weight loss videos and change them so yeah so yeah guys if you do meal planning you should follow the weight loss um page and um let us know how you do it and whatever because i don't know where to start with the weight with the um meal planning so and I'm still debating if I want to take like a supplement or something. So, yeah, leave it below. Help us sister out, okay? And if you're on a weight loss journey, tell me what you're doing. And um, how do you eat? Like, what do you eat for breakfast? Do you do any type of um, like baggy, like the things that I showed you guys? Or any like um, little fiber bars and stuff like that. So, yeah, guys. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your Monday. Monday. Today's Tuesday. Oh, my gym. Your Tuesday. Your Wednesday. Because I don't know when I'll be back. <laughs> so, you yeah, guys. Enjoy the rest of your week. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.